Okay, we're here at 1484 Scott Avenue here in Los Angeles. Now, we're here to check the main sewer line. We obviously cannot check every pipe in the house. You'll have your general inspector. There is a plumber over here that they'll inspect whatever they can. It appears the house is probably on a concrete slab. And uh, this inspection is based on my opinion. And we're running our camera from this four inch two way clean out. This is where the pipe exits the house over here. If you face it from the street on the right hand side. And we have our camera in the line and it actually goes to Levita Terrace. It appears that it probably, and I'm pretty sure that it connects with the house next door on the north side, but uh, that I cannot tell you 100%. I cannot go onto the property next door because I don't have permission to do that. Now, we have our camera in the line and we're all the way out to the city connection on Levita Terrace. So we're going to bring the camera back. So there's the city sewer. As we come back in a big six inch clay pipe, coming back from the middle of the street towards the property line. Now, you're going to see little bits of little roots, a little minor, minor surface cracks and things like that. I look for big problems in the sewer line, like big holes or collapses or major roots, things like that. Obviously, the pipe is getting a little old, you know, it's obviously the original pipe. But in my opinion, this looks like it's in pretty fair condition. So this is the main six inch pipe. You can see little bits of roots coming through the cup. Very minor little surface cracks. Very minor little surface cracks. It's very common you're going to find that on a clay pipe. So what it does, it comes onto the property. It's going to change it to an ABS plastic pipe. So this is all ABS plastic. This is in good condition. Motion detected in the front yard. Okay, stop, go forward a little bit. So right over here, you see there's a connection over there, and I believe that's possibly from the house next door. So anything beyond this point becomes a shared pipe. Now we're going to keep coming back. So ABS plaque, and then it comes back to clay piping, 4-inch clay pipe. As I mentioned, <coughs> it did have some minor roots in it. These can easily be maintained with periodic cleaning. Pipe on the whole, on the general speaking, looks like it's in pretty fair to good condition. Okay, so here it's going to come out of this clean out over here. I'm going to pause the recording. We're going to run our camera upstream. Okay, running the camera upstream, we've figured out that it goes all the way through to the next door property. So, it, because we're in 64 feet, which takes us all the way to the next door property. Obviously, these three houses over here share a common, common sewer line. So, we, we're going to bring the camera back. That's the end of the line, 62 feet away. It's probably even the next door property. There's little bits of roots coming into the pipe. The camera obviously went through pretty easily. You can see a little bit of roots in the pipe. <coughs> now, this is all my opinion, okay? So the line is functioning. It could be cleaned periodically. You know what? Stop here. Okay, so let's keep coming back. 
We're just entering into this property now, still in a clay pipe. And obviously, this clay pipe is running underneath this structure of this house over here. Well, it's got a lining over here. Okay. All right. So, okay. There's the the connection to this house. Okay. So, whatever was underneath. The, the structure had a lining, and this is the connection to the bathroom here. You can come back, and then it goes to a, a lining where roots are getting in. Obviously, linings don't stop roots from growing. Um, it's just a temporary fix, but this could be cleaned out with a hydrojet or very careful. You never want to run a cable with a blade through this lining because you will cut it up and destroy it. If anything, really, the line should be cleaned very carefully with a hydrojetter. However, to replace all this piping over here would be a very big job. And um, obviously, ultimately, that would be my recommendation. But that would take a lot of work, and uh, these, this line could be maintained until replacement is necessary. So it comes here with a lining. So technically, legality-wise, that's not really correct. You'd have to, you know, do whatever the building and safety and public works would require. As far as functioning, it is functioning the line. There's no doubt about that. We'll stop the recording over here.